Icy roads in Clark County played a factor in a deadly three car crash near Brush Prairie last night. Four people sent to a hospital. KBTV's Marilyn Deutsch joins us now from Peace Health, Southwest Washington Medical Center, Vancouver, with more. Marilyn, good morning. Good morning. I can tell you the roads are still very slick this morning. In fact, I think they're slicker now than they were when we first arrived on scene about three hours ago. There's a lot of frost on the roads here in southwest Washington this morning. But as you mentioned, this accident did happen in Brush Prairie. It was a three car accident happening in Brush Prairie last night. Four people involved brought here to Peace Health Southwest Washington Medical Center in Vancouver. Uh, we have some video that uh, I think you're taking a look at from a Fox 12 viewer, actually. State troopers say a 17-year-old was driving a Nissan Pathfinder when she hit a patch of ice. And she was heading south at the time on the Salmon Creek Bridge, but uh, that sent her across the center line, crashing into a northbound Chevy Tahoe SUV. Witnesses say that SUV flew up into the air, and then a third car slammed into the Tahoe's undercarriage. The driver of the Tahoe died at the scene. She has been identified as 33-year-old Jennifer Schwartz of Battleground. Her passenger, we believe, her passenger was her husband, was taken to this hospital also. And three girls in that first car that police say caused the crash, they were also taken to the hospital. They are ages 16 and 17. We believe they have serious and life-threatening injuries. Now, in that third car involved in the crash, there were two passengers, no one seriously injured there. Family members so happy about that. They just scratched their car on the side. They were right uh, behind the car that had on collision. They just missed everything by inches and seconds. They don't even know where, where they were, what lane they were. They don't remember. That road was closed for a time while police investigated last night. It's back open this morning. Some of the victims were trapped in their cars and fire crews had to use jaws of life to get them out. State Patrol telling us, kind of reminding us, that very often the first parts of the roads to freeze are the bridges. So always be very careful. They can be the most hazardous. And that, again, is where this deadly accident happened. Live in Southwest Washington, Marilyn Deutsch, Good Day, Oregon.